Good morning, everyone. We're back at Universal Orlando Resort. We are, I believe, heading into studios. That's usually where we head. We're kind of seeing where everyone's going. But by the wait times, it looks like it's back to normal. Uh, most things are five to 15 minute waits, uh, with Hagrid's being the longest, as usual. But they're not using the virtual queue, so that's kind of your sign that it's back, back to what it was like the past two weeks. So I think we're heading into Today Cafe to get some breakfast. It's about 10 o'clock. Heading into studios, and past few nights were horror nights. We have decided not to go to horror nights this year. We were very close to doing it, but they pack you in. It's very, very, very crowded and we're still not comfortable with big crowds. Uh, so we didn't really go near a lot of people this weekend when it was crowded. The other two weeks it was perfect, so yeah, maybe not. I got the croissant and mom got a, a cruffin chocolate. Oh, interesting. A cruffin. I don't know what that is. I'll let you know when I The girl at the counter said it was filled with chocolate and it's not yeah, very it, little. It's just on the top, but there's really no. That's what it looks like in the middle. And they don't heat it, so it's cold. Is it a croissant? It's like a croissant, yeah, pastry, but like hard. It's not. I would have preferred it warmed up. I would have preferred chocolate in there. No. Not a win. Not a win for me. And I got the ham and cheese breakfast sandwich, and it comes with shaved ham, cheddar cheese on a ciabatta bread, and roasted tomatoes. It's tremendous. <laughs> I didn't expect that much. That's much good for eight ninety nine. Eight ninety nine. And a side of fruit. It's the Bourne Show. It starts in five minutes. What's going on in Bourne? And we've been waiting to see the show for Gag. We thought Dad would enjoy it. And he will not come in. <laughs> because he's drinking his coffee. He doesn't want to give up his coffee. But it's like zero degrees in here. It's so cold. And he would have enjoyed it. Like, we, we were like, now we'll wait till Dad. He would. What? And right. he's seen all these movies. Yeah, like I have, I've never seen one. Movie. I don't. I'm not interested in this movie, but I'm I, just coming to see it. I have no idea what this movie's about. I just know Matt Damon's in it. So, but it's new. Got to do it. So we did Wait it for him. him. He's not here. He's not here. Please stand by for your trust door alliance with Homeland Security legal liaison, Nicolette Parsons. Thank you for agreeing to join this unique situation analysis team. Frankly, we need no start that. I need your help. As some of you may know, I was once an operator for the CIA, who along with the FBI went out of line. The stunt is spectacular, and it was fantastic. I, I watched it on YouTube when it first came yeah. out, and it doesn't do it justice. No, the, because I said, oh, I don't need to see that, boring. You have to be in the theater. It's yeah, the excellent. background is so clear. Like, I couldn't tell who was not but real and who was fake. It was, it was so good. It was excellent. Jason excellent. was awesome. They were all awesome. Would I, I wouldn't do it every trip, because we come so often, and it is on the longer side. Uh, but if you only came like once or a year, every couple of years, then definitely. It's a must do. Like I would do it once a year, probably. Yeah, it's a must do. You yeah, have to it was try real, it real, real good. Really good. Yeah. Really good. I wish they came out at the end to like bow, like they didn't. Yeah, they I did. was like, so we just clapping and screaming for them, but they did really good. Walking by this like meat store, and there's just a hand chilling. It's a QR code, so I wonder if you scan it. But yeah, just a hand. SpongeBob and Patrick with Betty Boop dancing in the background. like a 40 minute wait this weekend during Labor Day, it is back to a walk on. So that's when you know it's crowded when ET has a 40 minute wait. <laughs> Oh, here they come. Huh. 
You're not MIT. I can make it to a train. How come you don't have this suit? You were so good. Just got off of Man in Black and I wear a fanny pack and I put my like cup on the fanny pack and I've always done that, always gone on Men in Black. And the guy today made me put just my cup in the locker. There's nothing in it, it's empty. And I was like, oh, I've never had to do that before. The rule I thought was loose articles, which I, this isn't a loose article, it's attached to my fanny pack. So, are the cups like for some reason you have to put the cups away? It's attached, I, I don't, that's the first time it's ever happened. Gods have not gone on yet. 15 minute wait. Update, it is 1.30 on a Tuesday. Back to the crowds we saw the previous two weeks. Heading out of the parks, we are going to City Walk, grab some lunch, think we're going to Bread Box. I'm not sure if I'm gonna get that because I liked the buffalo chicken sandwich and I think uh, I'm gonna have buffalo wings for dinner tonight. Or a burger, I haven't decided. We're going to NBC. Uh, so I might grab either Red Oven or uh, Panda. And I decided on Red Oven. I can get Chinese food at home anytime. And I really like Red Oven. And I've only had it once this trip, which is usually I get it like constantly. It is 2.30, we are heading into Ions now, and here are the crowds. So I got the big eye pepperoni again at uh, Red Oven, so I didn't show it. But uh, now when you order, at least during this time, uh, you have to already know your table number, so I was by myself, so I was like, oh, I don't have a table number yet. So she just like gave me a table. Used to like have one of those buzzers that you put on a table. So, if you're going right now, you might have to pick out your table first. Just You got some of the characters out, and uh, shockingly, this is the first time I've seen Betty Boop in this area, and Toon. Even though she does have her own store here, I've only ever seen her at studios. Con is the only thing with the wait at 40 minutes. Everything else is 10 to 5 minutes. minutes to get on the ride so pretty accurate definitely the longest way here guess everyone loves Kong mom does I love Kong my favorite Jurassic is finally back open of course once Bradley left we did not get to do the flyers the floor is so sticky I could literally leave my shoe on the floor you hear that no I'm now heading on a forbidden journey. Familia does not want to go on, so it's just me. So going on by myself. See if single riders is open, but I think it's only a 10 minute wait. Heading in to NBC Sports Grill and Brew for our dinner. I got the eight piece traditionally fried. You can get it fried, uh, boneless, or grilled the, with the buffalo sauce. Mom got the eight ounce sirloin, came with mashed potatoes and asparagus. And dad got the little rack of ribs and mashed potatoes. Finished dinner at NBC and my wings are real good. Uh, I like their fried wings. Cooked perfectly. Good sauce, a bit of a smoky barbecue buffalo sauce. Or at least that's the taste I got from it. It was really good. Wings and fries, can't mess them up. Actually you can, but they were good here. <laughs> Mama, how was your steak? My steak was very good. Um, asparagus was too fat again. Yeah, I just bit the little soft in that one. No, it was very good. Womp, womp. Ribs no good. Very fatty. They leave the membrane on. So. He told me to remind him next time to not get the ribs. So don't get them, maybe. Yeah, they weren't good. Their burgers are real, real good here, and not one of us got a burger. So stick with the burgers, maybe. Yeah. Heading out. Studios just closed at 6 p.m. Have another hour of island. So let's see what the bus situation is. We are the first ones on this bus and there's no one waiting. So even with park closed, we good. And just like that, another day has come to an end. It was a universal day. Uh, probably our last universal day. We got in everything we wanted to. 
uh, parks were back to the low crowds, everything was a walk on. Calm was the only thing that wasn't at a 40 minute wait. Uh, it took us about 30 minutes to get through. Even Hagrid's was only a 20 minute wait. So, got on everything. And had dinner at NBC, mixed reviews from the fam. But the wings are real good. And early morning in, parents are getting a little tired. I have some work to do. Have to catch up on some shows, so I never mind an early morning an early night in. So with that I say good night everyone.